Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I've made several videos almost exactly like this, but this one's a little bit different, and I thought I'd help this person on Facebook. They wanted to put a cut line around this text and kind of make it look hand-drawn. And this is what I came up with, and you can change that a lot. So I'm gonna start completely over, because uh, I've already configured this text. So we're just gonna start over. This is a text, it is Times New Romans. Go up to object and break the text apart or control K. Select it all, go up to object and convert it to a curve. That allows you to weld it and create a boundary around it. We're gonna move that out of the way. You don't really have to, but it's easier to see this way. Then we're gonna to go to effects and contour. We're gonna to contour to the outside 0 0.09 with a rounded corner. And that's what you get. Now you can play with that and you can change that. Um, you can make them squared corners and that's not what you want. You know, if you want rounded corners and you want to kind of make it look like it's hand drawn. Now we're going to go to object and break contour apart and take the outside one and put it on top of our text. Now there is two internal parts because we didn't quite get too much, but we're going to go and break a curve apart, and then you can break these parts apart. Now you can still play with this, and we contour to, to the outside, now we can contour to the inside, let's go 0 0.01, still with rounded corners, and that didn't do too much, I did 0 0.001, 0 0.1, and you get a little bit lesser shape, let's go, uh, let's back up here and go 0.2, and then this way you can kind of look at it. Let's go point three. And we'll go to object and break contour apart and take away that outer one. So you've got a little bit closer feel and you kind of kind of play with which one you think is better. And because once you go out, you can always come back. And especially after you've got, if you, if you try to do this little bit of contour at first, it won't quite look like this. Let's just do that real quick. Let's let's take that contour and move it out of the way. And let's take this one, the one we want, really. Now let's take it. Well, here's our, no, we just need to make a new boundary. We'll put it down here. Now let's contour. So we did a point nine and we came back three, so let's go to the outside point six, rounded corners. See, it doesn't quite get there because it's getting so close. That's the exact same contour with the exception that we we went way out and then we came back three. So we went out point nine, we came back point three, which is point six of a contour. But you can see there's a lot more detail in this because it was it was closer. And when we went bigger, you can see the result. I hope that made a little bit of sense. And thank you for watching.